and welcome along. How are we all doing on this fine Sunday evening? I hope you've all had a good weekend. Um, I've I had a cracking day today. I I see that sound uh, that sound nineteen uh, was in the FSL earlier. Uh, FSL today, unbelievable. Uh, class annoyed the hell out of me. Um, <laughs> John Deere, neither John Deere or Trelleborg have made their journey to the final eight easy. I, I, I'm, I'm amazed by both those teams. Um, Burning Gamers, absolutely a congratulations on them going through as the winner of today's round. And uh, and yeah, just a, an amazing, amazing day on the FSL. Um, if you guys missed it today, uh, Group C is next weekend. I'm not co I'm not commentating for it. It's uh, Liz uh, Liz Tan and uh, Silver News doing next Sunday. I will be back commentating on the FSL uh, two weeks today. Um, but uh, but yeah, I so much fun today. So I hope you've all had a good weekend. I feel the skip afterwards as well. I did, I've had a busy, busy day today. Oh, actually, if I fall asleep, I'll check. Uh, it's, it's, yeah. Um, how are we all doing? Let's say hello to everybody in chat. Daniel Kinsberg, welcome along. Austin Boston, welcome along. Uh, J Man James, welcome along. FS17 Boy, welcome along. Rick464, welcome along. Eugene Creel, welcome along. Angry Dad Adam, welcome along. And thank you for subscribing with Twitch Prime. You've been subscribed for two months and you're on a two month streak. You are awesome. Thank you so, so much for your support. Um, Bradley Rangeley, welcome along. 123JCB13, welcome along. Heavy Set Mango, welcome along. Sloth Farms, welcome along, you baller. Uh, how are we all doing? FS17 boy, thank you for the host. I actually, I can't see my hosts. I can't see them. Chat, I can't see what's going on. I need to see what's going on. Uh, so, uh, yeah, FS17 boy, thank you for the host. You are awesome. Patrick Murray, uh, 14, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the BFN. Um, Austin Boston, uh, 002, thank you for the host. Uh, you are, are awesome. Um, and I think Netsound 19, thank you for the host as well. Uh, you are awesome too. Shall we kick this off? Shall we get going? Pause, pause this. Set our time. Oops, set our time. Two five times. I'm going to find our tractors because I think we've got some stuff to continue. Ooh, works on the out yesterday on the out. Ah. Right, I think we're... Oh, yeah. So this is... I should point out. So I realized after moving to the next day. This stuff in field 25 has germinated. So hopefully we can get this done quickly and this won't be too far behind. GB Modding, thank you for the host. You are awesome and welcome along. The honey log grab is a pain to pick up. Oh dear lord. How you doing, GB? There we go. Now we should be able to just continue with this. Yep, drive course. So that will just continue. And that will get our... I think that's the corn that's planting in there. Uh, and then we need to pop over the hedge. Drop the hedge to feel... Ooh. To field 24 to get the T-dub finishing off. This has only got to do a headland. Uh, so that will get our next field. Mid-spring, we're doing well. Uh, let's drive course with that as well. Good. That is all good. And now we can check on our cows. Because we have cows. Oh, cows. So cows, we need to get feed and stuff for. So that's going to be a concentration for today. I'm good, thank you, GB. I'm a little bit tired. I've had a very, very busy weekend. Um, been clearing up all the mess that's been made from the construction of the new bathroom. The Fisher J. <laughs> thank you very much for playing the long version. <laughs> Oh man. <laughs> it wasn't that I didn't like class today, it was that class were doing stuff which wasn't going to win them their rounds. And they kept doing it. That was the trouble. Right, what do we need? We're going to have to buy clover. What? what do they need? 
I'll stick by you. I'll uh, stick you all that you need. Clover or you alfalfa? We'll yeah. We need some grass fields and some mowers. I know I'll love you, darling. So give me your hand. Who are but what one? I want the most is all those acres of land. Because I got a brand new combine harvester and I'll give you the key. Come on now, let's get together in perfect harmony. I got 20 acres and you got 43. Now I got a brand new combine harvester and I'll give you the key. Wow, she's a lovely bit of stuff. Of course, seven long years are really no load in this place. You are sleeping are. in the kitchen. Hello Unicorn Butchery, welcome along. Oh yeah, we've got to do lime on field 24 next as well. There we go. That's how you sort that out. Uh, we we got this Ford last time, so we got the 7810 as a yard tractor last time to sort out our cows. There we go. Uh, I've got the smallest doll, so I've got the FZ30 on this. Seems to fit it fairly well. Um, I don't think there's that. It only comes with the stall clamps, I think. Um, it doesn't have any of the other clamps, so yeah. We need to get a bucket for this tractor. Right, there's some more feed for our cows. Wow, did they take... Okay. Oh, that's why we didn't... Is this... Okay, do we have the same... No, we don't have the same problem as this as we got on the Sandy Bay. That's a bit odd. Anyway, we'll leave that there for them to feed. Uh, we need to go and get a bucket for this. We need a small bucket for this for cleaning out. Ribbon Simulations YT, thank you for the host. You are awesome. Fiat Gaming 5678, thank you for the host. You are also awesome. And welcome along. How are you doing? Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll drop off the tool for this. And we're going to take this down to, uh, yeah, we're going to take this down to the shop and grab ourselves another, uh, grab ourselves a bucket. Uh, we then need to go down to the shop with the um, flatbed trailer. Uh, we need to go and buy some clover bales. Um, we need a few of those to get us going. Uh, but we'll take the other tractor down, uh, we'll take the uh, telehandler down there for that. In-game mod hub suits it much better. 15 Reno, welcome along. Hope you enjoy the stream. What did you miss on Friday? Was busy stuck in traffic to go see that. Ah, so we bought this on Friday. We bought this nice 7810 uh, for the farm. This is our yard tractor. Uh, because it, it has a very nice set of uh, front loader tools. Or front loader brackets on it. Uh, and uh, to also give our aging 7840 a bit of a rest. I am uh, choppy. I'm currently playing on keyboard and mouse because there's not enough space for my wheel in uh, in my current studio. Uh, when I go back to my uh, my 
Well, when I go into my new recording studio, uh, I'll be back to using my wheel. Uh, so yes, at the moment I'm keyboard and mouse, uh, I will soon be back to uh, side panel and wheel. So, Arthur's Farming, welcome along. You played this map today, it's your birthday, and it's your birthday, got a good night and grass one. Awesome, happy birthday, Arthur's Farming. So yeah, we got this uh, two-wheel drive 7810 to have a play with. Uh, right, let's get our bucket and then we need to head back to the farm. We don't need a massive bucket. We can do probably do with a standard one, I think. Probably just do with them in your fort, maybe. Where's the bucket? There's the bucket. 1,200. I don't think we need that much. I think we could possibly get away with this for a thousand instead of yeah we don't need such a big bucket we have a big bucket on our other stuff so we'll use this New Holland as all ah, right it's on the top <laughs> I think we'll go unbranded with this we're also gonna get it in the zinc which is great buy that for a thousand keep our price down we're never gonna be clearing up that much uh, stuff so that would be good and also we can spike bales with this we could actually get rid of our bale spike because we can spike bales with this as well so yeah this is actually a really good all round piece of equipment for what we're doing I'm doing well thank you Miller Gaming welcome along right there we go Let's get this back to our farm. Go and sort out the T-Dub. Uh, and then uh, we're going to bring... Well, then I think we're going to get rid of the bale spike. Because I think this will work as that. Yeah, we don't need... We don't actually need anything more than this zinc-coated uh, manure fork on it. And that will then keep us going and keep uh, work with the cows going quite nicely. And this setup on this tractor basically is all we're ever going to need with it. <laughs> we need the. We got a really, really big bucket for when we're doing uh, silage. I may buy one of our grass fields today and, uh, well, no, we can't really do any grass work until we've finished planting our fields. So that's the thing we've got at the moment. I think we're going to go and lime field 24 before field 25 gets finished. Although that, the T7 is pretty close to doing that. Um, and then we need to go, well, actually we could take the T7 and, uh, and go and lime field 24. While we move uh, our T dub onto whatever the next field it's needed for. So this should work. Okay, so first thing I want to check is will this work to pick up bales? It should do. It is a bale. It is a spike. Right. Drive out, drive back. There we go. Like so. So this should spike this bale, I think. If I get it at the right level. Thank you, uh, Fazy Kai Jamesy12 for the host. You are awesome. Yes. Yeah, so this this will work. We don't need a bale spike. We can just use this as our all-rounder cow uh, sort of bit of kit. So that's good news. And it will do to clear up this. And this will add a little bit of fermented stuff for our cows. Which is great. And keep us going. Yeah, for some reason on this map I'm, I'm having troubles with the, uh, the front loaders. They're, they're really, the FPS is really taking a nosedive. 
And I, when I'm not when I'm not streaming, I get a much higher FPS than this. I'm doing well, thank you, Jamesy. Welcome along. Right, so what I want to do is drop, actually drop the front off this, and just go and uh, and get rid of the bail spike because we don't need this bail spike anymore. And we've not had it very long. Good, just got off work. Awesome. Hello, Oliver Farron and Patrick Murray 14. This map is awesome. I love this map. We are going to... Uh, the barn is... The main barn is a nice size. The farmyard is wonderfully intricate. It's just an all-round great map, this, really. What gives me the writing under the help panel? Uh, that is um, uh, oh, that is the vehicle inspector mod, I think. If I can remember, if I remember correctly, drop that off there. Nope, nope, nope. Really? So, <laughs> okay. It can see the tractor out there. It cannot see the stole front load of it. So if we do that. There it is. Oh, we can't sell it here. Right. Answer to that. Is to get it onto here. And we'll send it back down to the shop to be sold. Should be able to sell it on the back of the trailer. And then we go put this back in the shed. Right, we'll go deal with our two tractors. So the T-Dub uh, has finished. So we've got that. Hello, Six Wheeling. Welcome along. Yeah, I'm doing well, thank you. Why the red front loader? Because it came with a red bracket. So, uh, yeah. That's, that's why I've got the red front loader. Because I've got a red bracket on it. So I wanted to match the front loader to the bracket. Wow. Okay. This has a couple of spots. Uh, love that. Uh, love. That actually worked really well. Let's go stop our other tractor. And then we'll come back here and sort that. Where is it? There it is. So we're going to do lime with the T7 now. Has a CCTV camera on it. That's really cool. Alright. Um, oh. Stop driver. That's quite cool. And actually, I want to turn that off like so. And that is the sunflower. So we need to go and unload the sunflowers from this now. And sort this out for the next time. That is not going to work. Let's go get the 7810 out of the way. Now that we've stopped our hired workers from costing us money. Farming Girl 27, thank you for subscribing at tier 1. You've been subscribed for three months. Oh, round we go. There we go. You made it, Cryptagri Chris. Welcome along. One more view. 75 viewers on my screen. 75 viewers on my screen. Time for tonight's ticket draw.
Make sure you get your entry in. And you could win one of two copies of the brand new upcoming Alpine Farming DLC for Farming Simulator 19. Only on PC, unfortunately. But it is, uh, it is a cracking DLC. Right, we'll unload this. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to unload this, put it in a position where it can be reloaded. And hopefully by the time we've finished, we'll be able to get our next crop planting. So, open that up. Uh... Lower it down. Fold it back up again. Yep. Oh, and we need to empty it. There we go. That gets that ready. And then we're just going to go off and hook up to the lime spreader. We end up doing lots of lime in the T7. Right, we do need some more lime. So we'll go and uh, grab some of that. Still got, we've still got at least three or four fields to buy and a combine harvester. We are going to be borrowing money on this series. But the, the fortunate thing is we should end up being able to repay it quite quickly. Because we've got a lot of fairly large fields going on. Now, is this a lime? I think this is a lime. Oh, no. Don't know what that's reloading from. About to find out, I think. Yep, that is reloading from that. Now, as far as I know, this is a lime purchase point. I don't, I'm not quite sure how it's working. Hey, Klaus, welcome along. Will this map get a Maze Plus mod? I hope so. I've kind of banked on it a little bit because I've got... Um, we do. We are running Maze Plus on here. And it will make it a lot easier for me to update Maze Plus as a result. I thought this was a lime refill point. Does say lime lime station in here somewhere? Hang on, is that? Yeah, that is where I am. Uh, Toxic Alfredo, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the BFM. Open the cover. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, but. It normally they open automatically. Oh, really? Where'd I unload those two? I've lost all my lime. There we go. I unloaded my lime and I don't know where... Oh, there it is. It's No, it's not underneath. I don't know where those went. Ask Alien Paul today. A dust day. Could become a partner. Still waiting for a spot. Ah. I hope so. I'm, I'm loving... I'm loving Maze Plus. I'm loving getting into maps. And I'm loving using maps with it. Uh, it is... It is, again, that next level of realism. Yeah, it's probably gone quite a way over, I think. Oh, I've just done it again. Right, I've got to find out where all of those have unloaded. They're not in here. Is 
Zack them out here anywhere? Just spent all that money on the lime and it's disappeared. Other way. It's not in the chickens. Maybe it un did it unload it into the silo? This month's good question. Oh, there they are! There they are! <laughs> They're all in here. Okay, we're going to have to move the truck. What's my crop rotation? I'll go through my crop rotation in a minute because we've got to move... Um, once we've got this lime sorted, we move, need to move the T-dub and select our next field to work on. Evening, uh, evening, TBR. Evo Saxo, welcome along. Now I've got to keep. I got to press N instead of I. Hello, Adventure Gaming, welcome along. Right, there we go. Uh, yeah, only on PC, I'm afraid. Uh, I've tried doing giveaways for consoles before and it just doesn't work. Kieran1995, thank you for those. Welcome to the VFM. Yeah, it's too close to the uh, chickens the other way. Martin ML Gamer, thank you for the host. You are awesome. Guys, check out Martin. Fantastic streamer. Welcome along, my friend. Right, is there any more at the back here that I can reach? Yep, there is. <laughs> is it just the one or is it multiple? No, it's just the one at the other side of the, by the looks of things. Can't see any more. Yeah, just the one. Let's see if we can fill this up. Kevin Moore, 553, thank you for the host. You are awesome. Adventure Gaming, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the BFN. I'm doing well, thank you, Martin. Yeah, I've had a good day today. Busy day, but a good day. I haven't stopped since about 6 a.m. this morning. I think I, I think I sat down for maybe an hour all day. Or, or rested for maybe an hour all day. Crypt Agri Chris, thank you for the host. You are awesome. Right, let's see if we can get this last one. And there we go. Right. N this time to close up. Flopper 88, welcome along. How are you doing? 6 a.m. Yeah, no, I started at 6 a.m. Recorded this morning, or recorded today's video at 6 a.m. Um, was actually quite pleased. Went well today's video. Although, does mean that this weekend's videos were both, um, <laughs> both turned out to be, uh, Mowing videos, but never mind. Was was a slightly different setup. Gareth forty five, Charles, welcome along. Uh, another good, brilliant stream on it. Thank you very much. 
Right, let's take this. Yeah, I what I love about this map is that I have farm trucks. I spend most of my time on my farm, not driving around roads. Absolutely brilliant. Right, there we go. Right, this up. Uh, take that off. go and then we need to decide which field we're gonna do next once we get this going I think we want to get this to end up in this corner here Right, uh, there, course generation. I have updated course play. I updated course play after the last time. Have an important fix. Oh, Dusty Dave. Yes, please. Uh, what's the fix? <laughs> uh, unless you want to message me about it rather than mention what it is in here. Uh, we'll do headlands. We want to do two headland passes. Oh, slow point at the main farm. Okay, will it require a new save game? Do I need to uh, bring my save, uh, adjust the save game? Nope. Good, excellent. Clockwise, up, downs first, smooth. Yep, generate me a course. It's thinking about it. There we go. Yeah. That should, uh, that should work really well, actually. Right, let's go and get this field done. Oh, what I do want to do is sort those patches of grass out. Should be fine for this to be doing this while we're uh, while we're sorting this this grass out. Right, uh, first waypoint drive course. Yeah, so hopefully, ah, uh, note the issue I have with. Course blade not fixed. Yeah, issue I have with course blade definitely not fixed. Soggy Scampy, welcome along. So where's that? So this road here, where does that lead? Does that take me up to field? Is there a gateway there? Yeah, there is a gateway there. So we could get field 23 as well. That would be quite cool. So field 23 would be a good one. That is connected to our farm by the farm track. Um, but really, we should probably head out on our other farm track as well. What course play uh, build am I running now? I'm currently running version 6.02.00044. Wow, and there's a gateway into it there. Okay, yeah. I think I think field 23 is a is a definite possibility for us. In fact, let's fold this up because we have no more grass to sort. And we'll have a look at field 23 and see how much it is. And we'll have a look at our rotation while we're at this. So uh, our rotation is wheat, canola, barley, corn, sugar beets, sunflowers. Uh, is what we're doing on the rotation. 
Uh, yeah, Fields Ready 3 is a fair-sized grassland. We are going to turn it into an arable field. Uh, let's have a look at how much it'll cost us. It's 160 and we have 140. Versus 198, 207, or 102. Right, what have we got planted so far? So, so far, we've planted our wheat, our barley, our canola, uh, our corn... So we need we need one more field. So field 23 would be a great final arable field to fit into that that lot of uh, that lot of fields there. It's either 23 or 8, and 8 is a lot more money. So uh, yeah, and then we're gonna have to borrow money to get 11 and 26. So our crop we're gonna put in field 24, I think, is sugar beet. Yeah, sugar beet is what we want to plant today. But our final crop to go in, I think, is corn. Tell me we we'll put some. Oh, we must have put. We must have put sunflowers in. Please tell me we we'll put sunflowers in. Twenty-five is sunflowers. Yes. So twenty-four will be uh, sugar beet because we don't have any of that in yet. Yeah, we've got no sugar beet in yet. So 24 will be sugar beet. 23 will be corn. Is what that will be. Okay. So let's borrow our first money. And that, that actually is pretty good. To get all of our arable fields. Having uh, borrowed only 10,000. That's brilliant. So buy that. What? Oh, we are so close. We've got to borrow 25,000 because we're a couple of hundred out. Uh, buy it. Yes. Okay. So there we go. Good size farm we're starting off with here. Uh, would buy the DLC as a gift. I suppose. Uh, it wouldn't. I've tried. Uh, I've tried that. I, I. Yeah. I've tried all sorts of ways. I think it was an Xbox winner we had. It was either an Xbox or a PS4 winner we had. And, uh, and yeah, I, I couldn't fulfill it. And we tried. Uh, they and I tried so hard to fulfill it. And it was just, yeah. Right. Let's uh, generate a course. Field 23. Current vehicle position. Uh, headlands 4... Clockwise, up, downs first, turn in the corners, generate the, of course. There we go. Who won the giveaway? Last month's giveaway was won by Farming Girl 27. Alright, so. Yeah, I like this part of the map. This is brilliant. Although I am, as I said last time, I am just ploughing all the Dave's grass fields. We only need two grass fields. Oof. Okay. Don't know what happened there. But we will drive across. What is that doing? No. Stop. First breakpoint. Let's try that instead. Of course. And away it goes. Perfect. Yeah, so this is going to be our corn. So we're doing, we're going to be planting sugar beet in 24, corn in 23. Uh, and that will be two really great fields of that.
Over the hedge. Wow, this has almost finished this job already. In fact, yeah, this is going to be finished by the time we get to the corner. We'll go and fill in the couple of bits that it's missed. Uh... Yeah, there we go. Right, and... Really? Oh! Why are you doing this to me, course play? Right, we've got to transport... Transport over to here. Right. And then I'm going to have to enter vehicle. Yeah, this has lost all course plate. Whoa, 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 no, no, not control alt delete. <laughs> yeah, I've got no way of stopping this tractor. And I don't, of course, play it has. That's, that's what happened, was course play rat has uh, run into an issue. So we're going to have to enter this, save this course play course, save F23, plow, and wait till this starts running its next thing. Quit out and come back in. I don't think it's with just that tractor. But I definitely, definitely went and did uh, updates to that the latest version of course play. Right. Stop driver. Reverse it up a little bit. Save our game. But the only way we can stop that tractor from uh, running course play at the moment is to quit out the game and come back in which is just oh, that's a little bit mad so we'll do that we'll quit out we'll come back in and uh, and that should uh, that should sort that Mistopheles 39 welcome along raffles going we're raffling away. Hello, Mr. Maltese Panda. Welcome along. Roberto Duby. Uh, Re sorry, Roberto de Bobbo. Bobbo? Welcome along. Right, let's try this again. Continue. And start. There we go. What is that? Oh, pants. <laughs> oh, I think there might be one running. Nope. Now there is. While I'm at, while I'm doing this. I think our first year here, we're going to do pretty well. My plan is once we, uh, well, we're going to try to pay off any loan we have to get to set up the farm. Is my aim of my first year's worth of crops. If we can do that, we're going to end up borrowing a load of cash. Use code FRESH533, welcome along. All right, so we're going to, we're going to have to borrow a load of cash to get ourselves set up fully on here. But we should be able to pay off most of it in the first year. Uh, which will be good. Uh, we I, we don't own the BGA, but the BGA is not expensive on this map. So that's good news. Right, let's go sort out our tractors. Right, uh, yeah. Realism experiment. I need to run over to them. And I am planning to do... Uh, yeah, I'm planning to do... Two different types 
Yeah, we're going to do two different types of um, uh, of stuff in that. Right. Now, let's go start the other tractor first, actually. We might do, considering the trouble we're having. I'm amazed that the trouble we're having is with course play and that tractor and not with the T-Dub. Far dodgier mod the T-Dub. How long have I been streaming for? Uh, 45 minutes. What's my crop rotation? Okay, I'll go over my crop rotation again in a minute. Right, of course. There we go. That's that tractor started. Oh, lots of running. Lots of running. Whole idea of this is to add time. I think I need a new combine. Got 35. Ah, you don't need a new combine, Fisher J. Need groats. I am on a new map, Mr. Maltese Panda. We have switched over to Bessie Beneath because it is a fantastic map. Uh, and. Okay, closest door. Um, yeah, Crossplay does not like this T7, I don't think. Get into this corner. And get this covered. Like this. There we go. Turn that off. And then I think we've got a couple of patches around the field that need doing. Yeah. So this corner, it's missed a few bits. It's a bit tight. And then we'll swing around here and that should get that. And then there's a bit over here. They are not mine. They might be my son's. I, yeah, I absolutely cannot wait until I use the steering wheel again. Absolutely. Steering wheel and, uh, and my side panel. I miss my side panel so much. Um, and I can't wait for the new studio. I mean, the new studio is just going to be awesome. I think you guys are going to love it. <laughs> Let's fold this up. Uh, we're actually going to leave this in this shed down here because we're going to need this uh, lime spreader uh, once we've finished with the cedar. So let's just park this here. Awesome bale shed that. We're going to use the ones down at the main farm for ours mainly. If Bessie releases tomorrow, I'll be so happy. I don't think it's going to release on console tomorrow. It's released on PC already. It's available now. I'm not sure if it's been released for console testing yet. Into the arc and we'll go pick up our cedar. Where do you attach the hose from the 
equivalent uh, what to in which way what to the tractor or sprayer I want that one these two Yeah, no, no, it's, it's, Marky is a 35, I thought I'd fix that. Maybe I hadn't copied that across. It's a, it's a 25, not a 35. Uh, oh, it's here. We are going to have to get a bail spike. We have a bale spike, actually. That is specifically for round bales. Uh, it's it's not. It's it's to do with the configuration, uh, JCB. So the configuration we've got of the TW25 is the TW35 configuration. Um. I have got a fixed version. I haven't put it in my mods folder yet. That's what I need to do. So we're going to have to borrow money to buy our combine. Uh, we're also going to have to borrow money to probably rent a sugar beet harvester. And whatever sugar beet harvester I rent, I need to make sure it's got the, um, it's got, uh, work in, uh, wet conditions or work wired with wet crop turned on, as we discovered on Sandy Bay last night. There's an oversight in some of the equipment. Yes, you can. Uh, you can use it. You can use it on any map, uh, Angry Dad Adam. Um, what you can't do is harvest any of the crops. So at the moment, I can't harvest clover or alfalfa or carrots or anything like that. So any crops like that, I have to go and buy at the moment. Right, we are going to do sugar beet, aren't we? Uh, sugar beet is which one? Maize, sugar beet. I do love this, this real seed mod. This is just awesome. Nikito96, welcome along. Run Simulations, welcome along. Need to add it to Sandy Bay. Yeah, I think we probably do. I think uh, I think it's a needed mod on Sandy Bay. I might have to unfold those to load this up. Right, let's get the fertilizer in first. Had a bit of a look at uh, wet harvesting issue. Been playing about with a few modern tools. Should have a bit of time tomorrow. Okay, cool. Uh, the maze plus being reworked. Uh, just before. Maze plus is being reworked. Just so to inform everyone that if you use maze plus, it will cause your game to crash. I have not had my game crash with Maze Plus at all on any of the maps I'm using it. Cowboy Mike. I'll have a word with Alien Paul, see what he says. Okay, keyboard works fine. It's 
just the mouse that it's having issue with. It tells you how, yeah. Some new farms that are being released this week. Okay. I've I've not had it crash my game on Bessie Beneath. I've had course play crash cause issues on here, but I've not had Maze Plus cause issues on here. Well, yeah, that that was my fault, though. In all fairness, uh, right. Unfold back and refill. Oh, hang on. Unload the sunflowers. No. Oh. Need to take the sunflowers away. So it didn't use the sun. It didn't use the sunflowers in the back. That's weird. It just used the ones. It's created two pallets of them as well. Right. Okay. Won't take sunflowers in the very back. That's a bit weird. Uh, sorry, it won't take sugar beet in the very back. Do I think you'll be doing anything on Green Bell's new map? I have heard nothing about Green Bell's new map at the moment. I don't think. Looks Pog, Northern Ireland. Uh, I haven't, no, I, to be honest, I haven't seen anything on the Northern Coast. I haven't seen the Northern Coast at all. Interestingly enough. I need, I don't, for some reason, Green Bale's Facebook page doesn't come up in my Facebook feed very often. Right, let's try refilling this. Okay, why won't this, or maybe I... That is just weird. Why will sugar beet not go into this? Good Northern Coast teased it on his YouTube. I'll have to check it out. Yeah, there we go. You have to be at the side to refill with this. My trouble is, I have so many really awesome maps at the moment that I'm uh, that I I got I've got a backlog. I have I have an absolute backlog of maps, and I'm kind of going right. Where do I fit this map in? Where do I fit this map in? 
For example, Dalton Dalton Valley Farm uh, has uh, what released in the last three four days. I won't get to play. I won't start playing that for another week or so, at least. I'll be looking. I will be looking for a new roleplay map soon. I think. Or maybe something alternate to do on uh, on another day of the week. There we go. Back her up. And off. Thank you for the follow, Ed. Tech Zook. Zook. Techzog Zero, welcome to the BFN. Not complaining, just yeah, lots, lots of maps being released at once. There's no way I can play them all. Uh, Medani eighty seven, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the BFN. The best I can hope to do is do lots of first looks. And uh, and give you guys some entertaining series on some of my favourites. Forestry instead of roleplay. I might do that, Land Rover uh, Max. I'm very tempted to bring back Forestry Friday. Very tempted to bring back Forestry Friday. Because there have been some absolutely amazing forestry maps released. Yeah, you, you do get lots of good maps overlooked. Hey, Morpheus Simulations. Welcome along, my friend. Go check out Morph, everybody. He is awesome. Right, let's see. Of course, Blade is going to swear at this again. Right, I want to try and get this to finish at this point here. I think it's not going to get into that corner. Okay, let's see if course play will work with this. Uh, field work, uh, fertilizing and seeding, course generation, field 24, headlands, uh, I think we will do three, uh, no, two headlands should be enough. Clockwise, up downs first. Taken Fanatic 398, thank you for the 100 bit cheer, you sir are awesome. Um, Spam. I don't know what you typed. Is something that in, it, that's in Nightbot's uh, banned list. Generate me, of course. There we go. I think we're lo are we lowered at the moment. There we go. All sorts of weirdness going on. Yeah, getting fertilized. The, the, this, one of the things I love about this cedar is the fact that we're getting uh, a stage of fertilizing down as we seed. Saving us a lot of time. Message looks fine. Nightbot being weird. Uh, Nightbot can be weird from time to time. First waypoint. Right, let's see if we get stuck in the tractor again. Nope. That time, no issue. Uh, Kelchi 1983, thank you for subscribing at tier one. You've been subscribed for six months. You are awesome. It contained the word shout out. We don't do shout outs around here. I will say hello. Uh, Daniel Skinsberg, Skinsberg uh, thank you for the 10 bit cheer. You are awesome. And in Nexus, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the BFM. What triggers it? Nightbot. 
Uh, but yeah, I don't do shout outs. I will say hello. Did you did you purposefully write shout out sloth? <laughs> Not bot will bop you. Hey Inexus, welcome along. Hope you enjoyed the stream. Right, we uh, we don't need this. We need a bail spike. I think we're going to end up leaving uh, most of our JCB tools here. Actually. <laughs> right. And back it up. I'm hoping this is going to hook up to this. Yes. No connection points though. Uh, am I using May Plus or am I running? I'm running the Forage extension. So yeah, Maze Plus and Forage extension. I can't run any more than that because I don't have enough uh, fruit height types. Right, let's go get ourselves some uh, clover silage bales. I'm probably going to have to borrow some more money for this. Although they're not too expensive, so it shouldn't be too bad. Uh, we're not buying any straw bales. We'll do straw once we um, uh, once we get a little bit further along. Might buy some um, uh, some uh, um, uh, WCS bales, whole crop silage bales, uh, and then we're covered for most things. But we're probably going to get a forage harvester before... Uh, sorry. Uh, yeah, we're probably going to get a forage header for our forage harvester before we get a... Um, uh, before we get a baler on here, I think. Have I got a combine yet? I have not got a combine yet. No. But thankfully, my combine is not going to be too expensive. So first things first, we want to go and sell the bale spike we've got on the back here because we have no need of that anymore. And uh, a good little bit of money back as a result. Ooh. There we go. Nope. Nope. Yes. So. Yep. Okay. Do that. And then we need to get some else. Just finished making Bessie ready for Maze Plus Seasons and Straw Harvest and all fruits. I would love to have Straw Harvest on here. I don't have the height types to do it at the moment. Finish making best. Ah, uh, yeah, read right that. Yeah, TX30. So the combine we're going to get, I freely admit, the combine we're going to get is this. I have modified this. I've taken the ABC things off the side because I thought they were a little bit ugly. Uh, but I'm going to go for the TX36 version of it with the extra capacity. Uh, no GPS, um, but yeah. Uh, and probably the Michelin tyres. That. That is an awesome combine. I absolutely love that. Uh, but yeah, we'll be going with that. Uh, but what I need to buy first is some clover bales. So we need uh, some... Yeah, here we go. Horse silage. What we want is clover silage. So as always, I get the clover silage in... 
the bright green, and we're going to take eight of those. Buy that, yep. Yeah. Uh, and then I also want some uh, standard silage as well. We'll get those in the black. There we go. Buy those as well. Oh, no. Wow. Okay. I think we can do grass silage instead, can't we? Yeah, grass silage I think we can do instead. So we'll do those in the black. Oh, eight. Nope, we do need to borrow. Did we actually buy the first lot? We didn't buy the first lot. Ha! Uh, right. Let's... Uh, we need to borrow some money. It's very simple to edit. You allow more fruit types on your map. Uh, Oh, cool. Let, let us know, Morpheus. I, I, yeah, because I'd like to use uh, the, um, I'd like to use the D1000 baler, but I need to, I, I need more fruit types because I have to add in, uh, I have to add in the uh, straw harvest add-on in order to add the D1000 baler and that requires the extra fruit types. Which is a pain. This map, it has already... This map already has the extra height types, does it? Dusty Dave, you still in here? Does this have the height types for me to be able to turn on... If it does, that would be awesome. Uh, right, we need to borrow a little bit more money. Yes, it does. Oh, I'm going to have to... Let's take our money up to 20,000. I'm going to have to bring that in because I want that baler. Uh, and we... I think we want... We do want... What do we want? So, we've got... Oh, uh, no, we need... Uh, yeah, so we've got clover silage and we made grass silage. Perfect. Good evening, Tony. Welcome along. Right, bales. So we're going to get grass silage bales because they're cheaper. Uh, we'll get them in the black as well. There we go. Bye. Yes. Okay. Uh, and then we want clover silage as well. Get them in the green. Bye. And then we just need to get some grass for our cows as well. Not worried about piercing these because they are already uh, fermented. And the nice thing about this is I should be able to... If I get this in the middle, get all four bales pretty securely. Yeah, come on. Yes! Look at that. Incoming raid from Twin Cam Gaming with a party of six. Welcome, 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 raiders. Oops. Hope you had a good stream, Twin Cam. Hello, Tim Woodhouse. Uh, Bowser Dragon, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the BFN. Ooh, that's got that one in. There we go. One of the mods could give uh, Twin Cam a shout out, please. No, we're a little bit over to the left. Now we're a little bit high. And we're definitely not straight. Let's try this again. Right, and there. That should do it. Hello, 
Gamer 554, welcome along. Insane Snake Eyes 7, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the BFN. That's all right, Twin Cam. My pleasure. You were kind enough to come and raid me with your uh, with your community. I would like to return the favour. Oh no! Oh, there we go. No. There we go. We get the level right, it's fine. Ooh, come on. There we go. That's one. It's got those on. More arable field first or bigger combine first? Um, no, we've got all our arable fields now. Uh, we actually need to get a grass field next. Yeah, grass field is our next purchase. Um, we go with so to round out our farm, we've got uh, four. We got four, six, nine, twenty-five, twenty-four, and twenty-three. So that's our arable farm. I want to get eleven and twenty-six either side of our driveway, starting with eleven. And we'll probably try and earn some money from uh, silage. But those two are going to be expensive. I think I think we're probably going to end up getting 11 first. And then uh, the other one later. Uh, this is not the awesome Sandy Bay. That is for the other <laughs> live stream. That will be covered in Wednesday night's live stream. Uh, Rinse Ward, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the VFN. I have a solo player on the same map leasing the fields around Dairy Farm. Ah, cool. You have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 11, 12, 5, 26. Nice. Uh, L Skin Gamwork. Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the uh, BFM. Let's load these up. Yeah, our T7 is in need of some fuel, so we'll go refuel that when we get back. 13,000? How do we have 13,000 litres of grass silage? These are 4,000 litre bales. I'm guessing the grass silage bales are slightly smaller. Uh oh. Ooh, that did not like that. There we go. Whatever happened there, that did not like that. Nope, no idea. Yeah, they must be. That's all right. We've got, we've got plenty. We're actually not going to be doing. Uh, as I said, we're not going to be doing bales straight off. There we go. Yeah, I wish I could give. Um, console versions of the uh, Alpine uh, uh, the, the Alpine farming DLC away but they make it so they make it almost impossible to um, to gift games on consoles I've and consoles are going uh, consoles are going uh, you know download only and you cannot gift a game I cannot gift a game from my PS4 account to somebody else which is nuts. I can do it on Steam. I can get a code and email it to somebody on something else. I cannot do that on a PS4 or an Xbox. Why? Why will you not let me buy stuff and give it to people? Right, giveaway time. Let's get these bales back. 
and uh, and then we'll go and uh, go and give them away. I could GB, but I need someone's address for that. And that's where we fell over last time. I can buy a gift card, but I have to physically mail it to somebody. So if we can, if if I can gift, so I can gift on Xbox, can I? Because if I can gift on a PS4, I definitely can. I've tried it. If I can gift on Xbox, I might be able to uh, to extend the giveaway to that. Oh, I try. I tried sloth. We jumped through so many hoops to try and, and give away stuff on PS4, and just couldn't. It got very, very annoying. Oh, you get codes on the back. Ah, oh, can't wait for Wednesday. Your fence. Oh yeah, I've got to add the fence. Right. Uh, before we go any further, let's pause this. Let's uh, switch out to this screen here because, as has been pointed out, it is giveaway time. Closing the giveaway, or closing the ticket draw for today's free ticket into the giveaway. I don't, I don't want to give away money, GB. I don't, I don't like to give away money. I would prefer to, you know. Right. Draw a winner. Who's our winner tonight? Grizzly 2020. Are oh, you here in the chat, my friend? Did I just... I didn't... Not raise you off. That's good. Are you here in the chat, Grizzly? Congratulations, Grizzly. I'm copying. Uh, congratulations, Grizzly. You have got a free entry into this month's giveaway. Nice. Uh, right. Shall we continue on, people? Shall we continue on? Uh, I, I managed to get Coke on my glasses. Or Pepsi on my glasses, to be exact. Right. Oh, ah, there we go. No, that's still fuzzy. Never mind. Right, let's unload these bales. We're going to have fun getting around that stuff, aren't we? Oh, okay. It's all right. Right, and we'll do the same again here. We're going to try and get these out two at a time. Ooh. There we go. Oh, we've got enough space to get down there, so that should be alright. Yeah, so these, this shed, we're going to, we've got to buy clover silage all the time. Until maize plus, uh, until the maize plus fruits, if the maize plus fruits are available on here, uh, then we need to, uh, we've got to buy clover silage. Um, we're all right for grass silage. We can make that ourselves. Uh, we're going to be making that in a big shed. And maize silage, well, maize silage, actually, we can make ourselves as well. So, yeah. We're going to be making both of those, I think. We're probably going to be, yeah, we're probably going to be using our grass fields to make hay and then uh, be making maize silage. Oh, no, how have I mucked that up so badly? Right, push those back on. Did we just pick them up? Oh, we picked them up too high. Right, let's, well, let's just take these two then. Mods player moving permanently on to Wednesday. Uh, it will be moving. It will be moving permanently to Wednesday for now, culture. Um, I uh, because we're going with three times a week on this. Uh, I'll be honest with you guys. We are going to start pushing for partner again soon on here. Uh, so I want to be getting our uh, averages up. And uh, in order to do that, we won't be doing snow run up for a while. On. Uh, on Twitch, um, because SnowRunner, SnowRunner runs at about thirty average, uh, and I can't be doing that if I'm doing a push for partner. A 
Later, Martin. Thanks for joining us. Whereas on here at the moment, we've got 107 people watching. That is awesome. Thank you so, so much, everybody watching right now. It means it means the absolute world to me. I kid you not. You are you guys are absolutely amazing. Right, so there we go. I think it was the T-Dub we ended up having to refuel last time, wasn't it? Ah, oh, there we go. Let's just see if we knock this end one on. 113 people. It's, it's Mine lags a little bit, but still, oh, well over 100 people watching. You guys are absolutely fantastic. Thank you very, very much. Okay, Morpheus, catch you in a minute. Right. Let's get this lined up. Hopefully, get this lined up better than we did the last lot. There we go, that should do it. Nope. I want to undo those. And there we go. Yeah, we can be quite low on the higher ones, just to stabilise them. No Canadian Gamer, I am sorting all of that tomorrow. It's been hanging around way too long. Um, I want to get all of that stuff out to you guys. And uh, yeah, I'm, I'm unhappy with myself. So, I can get all of that out. I should have all the information from everybody to get everything sent out. Hey. Right, let's get this up. And on. Yeah, if we can get the sugar beet planted today, that would be excellent. That leaves us day five uh, of, uh, so late spring, perfect time for us to get the, uh, get the corn in. And, uh, and yeah, then we'll be in great position. And what I want to do, actually, is before our crops get too high, I want to start getting some slurry. Um, but didn't I see they just say that uh, the slurry thing wasn't working properly? So we might have an issue with that. Um, but I'll get that uh, fixed, and maybe next time we'll, uh, we'll be able to get some slurry spreading going. There we go. Right, so we need to go and get our yard tractor and feed our cows some of this. Actually, yeah, we'll take this round. Round and round we go. Where we stop, only we know. Yeah, I'm... Uh, <laughs> yes, I've got lots of stuff to send out. It's been a bit manic the last few months. And with all the COVID stuff and yeah, I need to get my butt moving. Uh, the T7 does need fuel. We will get it fueled in a bit. Just going to park my... Park that up. Go and feed our uh, cows some stuff. Yeah, we've got two... Um, Two of those uh, lime bags in here. We need to move those out. Now we can't take two bales at a time. There is just not enough weight in this tractor for that. So I'm colour coding my bales like this so that I can immediately go, right, that is a grass silage bale, or that is a, uh, or that is a, um, uh, clover silage bale. 
and can immediately then just go and get the one that I want to get without too much of a thing. Uh, I will do once I once I get all the packages together. I will take a picture. I will do Fisher J because you sent me a message saying please sign your uh, please sign your uh, shirt. So yeah, it will be signed. Here we go. Let's drop off grass silage. Wait, that's in. So how much grass silage has that given our cows? Wow, they will take another one of those. When's the stream ending tonight? About half past ten. Well, sometime between half past ten and eleven o'clock normally. Depends on when our work on the farm is finished. Uh, we're doing pretty good at the moment. Go and get another one of those grass silage bales, I think. Uh, what day was it on Sandy Bay? I'm not sure. We're somewhere in autumn. Go guess 10.41. <laughs> oh, this is quite a long way. We need to get a uh, screenshot. I think we might get a shot of the uh, 78.10 on its way back. Yeah, I think that there is a great place to get a shot of the 78.10. go so that's good that's a nice amount of that so now we need some clover silage as well and as I said on the way back we'll get a screenshot what was for dinner tonight tonight was meatballs in a uh, uh, yeah in a uh, bolognese sauce of my own creation there we go Get all of that off. Oop. That will do rather nicely. So a Tesla charging at the petrol station beside me 20 minutes ago. Nice. Yeah, we did have a jar of bolognese sauce and I thought I'd try something different. Just throw a few ingredients about. Oh, no, we've got two of them. I don't want two. Just want one. 3,250 litres. Good. Whoa, we lost it. That's interesting. Why is the T7 220 in traffic? Any tips for getting uh, a, getting better at bail stacking? Um, do you know what, Angry Dad Adam? You've got you, you absolutely have your means of getting better at bail stacking. You've got 150 of them. Don't cheat. Just stack them. You'll get better. That's how I did it. That's exactly how I did it. 
Oh, you are kidding me. And it's off. We're probably going to have to... Yeah, we're still going to have to refill that soon. Should have refilled that then when I was doing that. Never mind. Should put more headlands on the next course. Use at least four with anything else. Ah, oh, I think... I Two is pretty good most of the time. Does, uh, does the job uh, mostly what I need it to. Are uh, you going to have someone have... <laughs> no, I will probably get them picked up from uh, from my house, Canadian Gamer. Much, much better social distancing wise. There we go. Right, how much has that... Oh, wow. That will do for that as well. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. Right, what we need to do as well is get some water. So let's do that too while we're at it. Let's do that. We'll just back this round here. Put our weight in this shed. There we go. Hello, Jack Wilson 07. Welcome along. Should allow us to hook up fairly easily. Yeah, there we go. Right, fill it up. So yeah, if we're lucky, the sugar beet will be in today. Um, and the uh, sugar beet will be in today. Corn will be in next time. We might be able to start working on our uh, on doing the hay next time. And getting a lot of hay bales. Welcome back, Oliver Farrell. Raffle. You certainly is a raffle. Wyatt 703 Max 12, welcome along. Hope you're doing well. Uh, yes, manual attach, that is um, uh, Insane Snake Eyes. Uh, PC only mod. I, I absolutely love it. I Now, if I have it turned off, I forget and I jump out all the time. It was something I, I found annoying in FS17. That I really love in FS19. And it goes a bit weird like that. Ed the Farmer, welcome along. How are you doing? Good pun there. (laughs) 
Yeah, we've not got any grass equipment on here yet. Oh. Right, while this is emptying the water, we'll, uh, we'll go and sort the T7 out. Oh no, it has sorted itself out. I'm hoping it's going to get to the end of the field without needing to be refueled. But we'll see how we do. Yeah, no, T7 is definitely having issues. As am I getting around this corner. Right, we'll leave that going. Can I show you? Uh, yeah, it, uh, I can do it. In a minute, I will, Oliver. Oh, we're going to have to do some weeding soon as well. We'll, put, we'll spray stuff with herbicide. Our, um, our 7840 is going to become our spraying tractor. So that will be uh, that will have care wheels on it most of the time now. Through the woodland. Okay, what? Where's the tractor gone? Uh, I do play console sometimes. At the moment, I'm uh, I'm playing PC. Don't know why it suddenly had a problem at this point in the field. Just go fill it up. Uh, okay, yeah, let's let's do that. No, no, wheel in the right place. Hello happy director, welcome along. I'm doing well, thank you very much. So yeah, just the headlands to do on uh, on the sugar beet and then uh, next time we should have the corn planted. Fantastic. To get to the end of the end of spring and have all of our well, to, to have a day in hand in spring and to get all of our crops in, that is brilliant. That is absolutely wonderful. Close the door. This tractor is probably going to be our mowing tractor as well. <laughs> Five point. We've only had this tractor since we started this map, and we've got 5.4 hours on it already. At least when we get to year two, things will be spread out a little more. We'll be able to do some of the seeding ourselves. And uh, yeah, and just just be able to do this. All right, and round and in. There we go. We 
should be able to get this to continue from where it left off. There it goes. I've got nearly five hours on the huddy. All you've done is cut down a few trees and got 5k and spent the full stream selling bales. Wow. Yeah, but it is pretty much the only piece of machinery you have at the moment on Sandy Bay, uh, JCB. Let's go check out our 78 turn. That should have finished. Down and round here. Yep, and how much water? So cows are all happy. Uh, chickens are okay at the moment. We do have some feed for the chickens actually. We could go and grab some of that, maybe. We'll have to use the uh, JCB for that. Yeah, possibly the little bucket would be a good idea for that. I think what we'll do... Is we'll push this into here. Get this refilling and then go and do the chickens with the JCB. Oh, there we go. Hudding is. Um, uh, have a look on the um, on the Giants website. That'll explain it better than I can. Um, right. Ah. T7 has got stuck again. But for 10 hours on this. Trapper 32, 23, 34, 44. Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the BFM. What tractors have I got? So I have a New Holland T7, um, a uh, TW25 Ford, a uh, Ford 7840 and a Ford uh, 7810. There we go, and... I think we can give carrots directly to them with this. Hey Trapper, welcome along. Yeah, that Haddock truly is the Swiss Army knife of tractors. Really, really is. Bye, Fit Gaming. Thanks for joining us. Hope you've enjoyed the stream. Uh, mainly Fords, yes. Uh, mainly uh, sort of 80s and 90s Fords as well. I'm. Uh, it's all from sort of the period when I was uh, working on, uh, when I did stuff on my dad's farm and grew up on my dad's farm. Oh, we threw them off. Didn't mean to do that. It's a pain to get them. There we go. There we go. Ooh. What I'm going to do is put them in a place where I can easily get at them. You have the t same T7 on Greenwich? I love that T7. Fantastic piece of kit.
Thank you, Trapper. Thank you very much. Thank you very, very much. <laughs> uh, along with an 8340. 8340 is great, but I have uh, I have fond memories of the uh, 7840. Having uh, driven one for a lot of summers, which is why which is why I can't let it go on here. It's it's why it's got over 70 hours on this series, and we uh, yeah, I just can't let it go. Right, this is where we keep our chicken feed. I think we need to go and put the uh, wheat in the bucket. Now, how much do we need? Okay, we don't need that much. So we'll drop this off at the front here so it's nicely out of the way. Oh. See if we can extract the bucket here. T7 is a great real life too. I have a brand new T7, T7, T10 and older. Devotee is raiding with a party of 15. Uh, Richie Evans, 1975. Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the VFN. Welcome, welcome, welcome raiders. Uh, we're going to get a TX36 combine on here. We don't have one yet. Devotee, thank you very, very much for the raid. You are awesome. Welcome, uh, welcome, 15 Raiders. Hope you have had a good stream. I don't, I don't have a button. I'm going to have to do this. Awesome. Yeah, there we go. Go check out Devotee. Great streamer. I have been in a few of his. Oh, wow. We didn't have much left on that pallet anyway. We probably had just enough to finish off the chickens, I think. Look forward to getting some wheat into the silo, and that will make things easier. No problem at all. Oh, looks like we have maxed that out. Have we maxed that out? Yep, we maxed that out. Yeah, the other thing that the chickens need, we we are making. Yeah, we're we're growing both corn and barley. Um, we're probably gonna feed them uh, barley rather than corn because I think we're gonna I think we're gonna silage the corn. And I think we'll probably do it in the smaller ones down the bottom. And get that can go in our silo. Oh, come on. There we go. That's better. Yeah, I really miss the joystick. Keyboard, it works absolutely fine. Mouse, it's just not behaving itself at the moment on this map. Take this back. So that should be our animals handled about as much as we can handle them at the moment. I want to see how much silage we've got. I'm going to have to open the coat. Get a dry throat. Oh, that's better. That would have either been uh, that would have been keep talking and you'll have a coughing fit, I think. No, it's still gonna be a coughing fit. Oh dear, that's what I get for talking too long without actually taking a drink. I I have not reapplied for partner. Um I want to make sure we are getting a steady, steady uh, set. 
Uh, I haven't planted corn. Corn will be next stream. It is the last crop we're going to do. It's going to go into field... Uh, field 23. That, uh, that is currently being done with that. That T7 is completely stuck. Okay, let's go deal with the T7 first. T7's shoved itself in the hedge again. Ooh, no, not that way. I do get lost in this yard. Which is uh, one of the reasons I love it, is I get lost in this yard. Thank you, Charles. We'll see. We'll see what I, I will. I will start going. I will start doing part and push once I have a, a nice, good level, and uh, and we're good again. So we'll see. We'll see how we do. Um, where is? Yeah, it's stuck in here again. Oh, right. Okay. It's in a tree. Wow, really in a tree. How is this this much in a tree? There we go. That's got it out. Right, where are we up to? Where is this? I think this is trying to turn around to go and do the headland. Yeah, so it comes up here. And what we'll do is we'll go and follow it for this bit of headland. See if we can get it to start at this point here. That's right point. Right, of course. Yep. Yep, there we go. And that's cracked it on the headland. Uh, your granddad's farmer driver Case International 455 and an Oh wow, a couple of real classic tractors there, Oliver. How did it scuff it? It has Course play is amazingly good at finding trees, Eugene. If you have a if you have a single tree in a hedgerow and the hedges have no collisions, course play will find that tree. Without fail, course play will find that tree. No, I, I may be three. Don't need as many as five with a with a six meter planter like that. Right, we'll start this up. We will unhook the water trailer because we don't need it. Uh, we'll put our weight back on the back because we do need that. Yeah, wait till we use course play for karting. There's going to be some fun there. Oh, oh, there we go. Right, and lift. And we'll go park this up in the shed because we're finished with this for the day. Got to work out. Oh, got to work out where we're going to go and put our uh, egg factory or our yeah, our egg sorting stuff. Why don't we go give our seventy-eight forty a little bit of TLC? I think.
So, uh, 1455 loader does the majority of the work. The 88 is only used for topping and telling. Yeah. Let's give this a wash down because this tractor is dirty. And we haven't really used it on here yet. I think we, I mean, we did. We used it to, to do some... Um, uh, we used it to do some uh, lime spreading, didn't we? There we go. So yeah, I think we're going to put a three-point link on the front of the 7840 and uh, some care wheels and make this our spraying tractor now. You have a Leyland. Wow. Forget what I mean by wow. <laughs> That's a good point. <laughs> I'm just talking to myself. Uh, we could hit with that. Yeah, I have no idea what I meant wow about. Oh, about the track. Yeah, no, uh, nice classic old tractor. Yeah, no, I see now. Uh, yeah, about the Leyland. Yeah, that is a really nice classic tractor. Another, another brand that just no longer exists. Uh, I have got that in here. Let's get this... Um, yeah, let's get the lime out of here. We don't need this lime in here. So we'll part this out of the way here. Come on. There we go. Oh, yeah. I am looking forward to getting back to my two PC setup. Just that everything runs that little bit smoother. I get like 50 FPS in here when I'm not running OBS. Hopefully, it's not going to be too much longer. I've got a lot of decoration and stuff to do, though. Once we've actually got walls. Uh, you and me both, Oliver. I really, really want to see a used tractor section. That, that you can buy tractors. Um, and they have hours on them. And they have uh, wear on them. And that kind of stuff. I would love to see that uh, in FS. That would be awesome. Right, I'm just going to put these next to this. Because they are lime bags. And we can fill up the... Next time we come to fill the lime, we can uh, we can use these first. Things that fall... Uh, I have asked Giants about that. And the reason why you don't see tractors break down fully or 
or you don't see damage on tractors is because of course um, uh, manufacturers don't want their equipment to appear like that rush gaming vcrp thank you for the follow welcome to the vfm so yeah that's that's why uh unlike snow runner you'll see damage on stuff um on uh, on farm sim you won't see that and that is and that is purely um because the the uh manufacturers don't want their equipment looking like that I use uh, bird use tractor stuff doesn't mean you know we have used equipment in when you take on a mission you get used equipment I don't think it's a massive leap I'm surprised I'm actually surprised it's not a mod that somebody's already done there was a lot of talk about um, a mod like that being created early days of FS19 and it's just never appeared and I need I need to learn Lua scripting if I learned Lua scripting I'd probably create it myself but uh, yeah, I'm a way off doing that at the moment. T7 is done. That's great news. Oh, true Land Rover Max. Absolutely true. I agree with you 100%. You know, if every time I hit a tree I got a dent, that would be cool. But yeah. Yeah, I'd like to. Th I'd like to see things like if you get down to zero on a tractor's um, uh, on a tractor with its wear and tear and everything, then uh, you end up with um, uh, the PTO not working or or a, a trailer being leaky or something like that. Rush Gaming VR uh, VCRP, you have come to the right place. <laughs> Stop driver. There we go. Let's uh, let's clear this course as well. Actually, there we go. Ooh. Ah, he says as he backs around and makes a horrible hash of it. Right, we want to get this corner done, and then we want to get that bit that's been missed out. Last bit of sugar beet. In the ground. Right, is there anything missed out on this field? Uh, nope, that looks like pretty good coverage, actually. I do, the latest versions of course play are so much better at the headlands. So, so much better at the headlands. I really, really like this planter. Oh, hang on. There we go. Uh, FS is already fantastic. Imagine if Giants had modders work with them. They, they do. That's the thing, Oliver. They do. I know several people who started out as modders who now work for Giants. Uh, the most obvious were, one is uh, a Raken. Who, who started off as, and is still part of the guys who created Seasons, Realist was modding, um, who, uh, who works for Giants. There are, there are many, many modders who have, have made the, uh, the move. And it's why, it's why there are, it's part of the reason, it's not the complete reason, but it's part of the reason why, um, uh, you know, the, they care for the game so much. I mean, they they giants absolutely love this game and, and want to make the best game they can. And they are very, very, very dedicated to this. That's why I get annoyed when people um, post messages and things saying, "Oh, giants don't care. Giants don't want." It's just not true. Uh, right, we'll leave this here because we're going to change this over next time. In fact, yeah, we'll leave this tractor here. Uh, we will disconnect 
this, I think. Oh, we need to lower it. Uh, make sure I got the right bit. Lower it. Fold it back up. Disconnect all that. Perfect. Might give this tractor a quick clean, actually. And then we can go and see how the T-Dub is doing. But we might get the T-Dub doing the... Um, uh, doing the line and uh, and get this doing the seeding behind it that would be uh, that would be a good way to go and then get really stuck into that final field yeah i'm i'm hoping for a, a bit of a rework with the next one although i have to say fs19 i am about to be perfect equipment set up that, that I've ever had in an FS game. I'm pretty much there now. Uh, the David Browns will just finish it off. So getting uh, getting mods over to uh, FS19, uh, FS22, it might be. That will be that will be something. There we go. T7 back. Uh, Mr. Ra Rapper. Welcome along. Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the VFN. Just working on... Yeah. I, I don't think it's going to be called Farm Sim 21. I'm, I'm like you, Oliver. I'm predicting... Uh, 20, uh, yeah, next year, next October, November, next year. Um, the thing I think is interesting is uh, that they're talking about next two years in that press release. So, is is FS uh, is FS19 going to be with us for another couple of years? When am I finishing? Uh, we're going to go and check on what's happening with the T Dub. Hopefully, we can get that to finish tonight. Hello, Sean T89. Welcome along. How are you doing? This better be good. <laughs> I hope so. But as I said, I love FS19. FS19. I've played FS19 every single day, pretty much, uh, since before its release. Well, that's the road. I don't want to go that way. There we go. Uh, I was I was fortunate enough um, that Giants invited me over to uh, uh, to have early access to ninety. That was that was amazing. Rush gaming, aren't we all? <laughs> I would, I would love to do this full time. I am nowhere near that. Partner is the first step, though. Ah, oh, now TW35 is going to need to be refueled at the end of this. Uh, I think we might have one more headland, maybe, to do. So we're going to follow this round. We're going to stick in the TW25. We've pretty much finished all the other work we've got to do today. Oh, this, oh, is this our last headland? Let's uh, let's bring this up actually. Let's find out. No, we've got one more headland after this to do. What tractors have we got in the background? I have a Voltra N series at the uh, top left, a David Brown 1210 in the middle, and a. Uh, Class Terra Truck, uh, top right, and a Ford 7810 on uh, the shelf below it. You've just passed. Wow, actually, that's a good question. I am. Uh... <laughs> 
3,885 hours in Farming Simulator 19. Wow. Which it makes sense. I make uh, I make five videos a week on YouTube. I uh, I do um, two. Uh, I do five streams a week here on Twitch. So yeah, that that kind of amount makes sense. You know what? I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna stop the driver because I've just realised. I am wasting money by doing this. We might as well. It's pretty obvious where our track is. So we might as well just drive it ourselves. Because we're costing money doing it. Someone's a bit of a tryhard. I've not even got like three days. To, uh, to that, yeah. Um, Hingsen HC. Uh, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the BFN. Well, as I said, this is pretty much a second job. I do spend a stupid amount of time doing this kind of thing. And I do spend about, yeah, I probably spend about 20 hours a week. At least doing farms and stuff. Go. Yeah, so turn these two grass fields into um, into arable fields. Good sized fields. We'll maybe have to get some of the bigger ones. Uh, after this year's harvest. This year's harvest should bring in some good cash though. With the size of the fields we're doing. Does the BGA on Charwell work on Xbox? As far as I know. It also depends on which version of Charwell you are asking about. Of course. Because there are now two versions. Right. Yeah, we're up to the edge now. That's good. You're on 257 on Xbox, but only had it since October. Uh, 700 on PS4. It literally blew up. Wow. <laughs> does the BJ work on Sandy Bay? Yes, I believe it does. Uh, JCB would be able to tell you about that because he has uh, he's the one who owns it on Sandy Bay on our multiplayer and I believe he has been using it I've got enough fuel to get this field finished, but we will refuel this tractor on the way back. Uh, and this actually, this is the last time we need to use the plow for uh, uh, at least until the autumn. Later, Twin Cam. Thanks for joining us. Catch you next time. Life lesson. Make sure you clear the dust out of PS4 stuff. Oh, wow. And then went bang. Yeah, that is not good. Yeah, 
Thank you. Right up to the edge there. I really, really like this plow slot. This this plow is my favourite plow in the game. <laughs> yeah, I do pretty much use it on every map now as well. Well, admittedly, the the other place I'm using it is on um, on Little Norton, and Little Norton I'm showcasing this DLC. So yeah, <laughs> it makes sense that I'd be using it there. Really. Don't know how far this goes into this corner. Okay, there we go. That answers that question. Really, I prefer PS4, Oliver. I I found uh, I find Xbox to be really low quality compared to the PS4. And Sandy, oh yeah, I am using this. Yeah, you're right, Charles. I am using this on Sandy Bay as well. <laughs> I do like this plow very, very much. I like the I like the packer is the thing. It's just, it's wonderful to see that bit that bit built in. Absolutely fantastic. Whoa, that was weird. Everything froze. And I am pressing the save button. You always use the six meter cheaty plan. <laughs> I have no idea what happened there. It skipped frames in OBS. My, my machine sounded like it was about to, uh, to have a big crash. Right, so lift that up. We'll clear this off. Not a good noise as well. Oh, sorry guys. I have no idea what happened then. Right, we'll get this back to the farm. Uh, we might give the plow a wash down because we're going to put it away. But that works pretty well. Is that our... Yeah, so that I think will be our grass field there too, won't it? Uh, work. Straight in front of us. I know. Straight in front of us is 48. That won't be our grass field. Realism. Yeah. Let's let's not be in that situation, please. And let's see if we can get this back before we run out of fuel. Because that would not be good. We do have we do have a little bit left in the tank, so we're good. It's all good. I don't know where I'm gonna put this plow. I think this plow will probably go in this shed actually. So this shed here is where we've been looking at putting implements. Just want to check. 
Yeah, that's good. Let's give this a wash down. Before we go and put it away. Tons of PS4 is better uh, all round for the Xbox. Okay. That makes sense. Get the tractor a wash down as well. Oh, wow, the lead does come out far enough on this. That's good. How far does it go? Oh, there we go. Yeah. Shiny TW35 and plow. Get this in here and then we can unfold it to put it away. Right, and then X. This is done really nicely on the back of this. Um... Right, and now uh, on the back of this TW25. Uh, I want to deactivate Packer. There we go. And then we can just put this here like so. Nice out of the way. And the T-Dub can go back in our shed. So yeah, we'll do the... Uh, Robbie we'll used this tractor to do the lime spreading next time. And then we uh, will look at doing the, um, the seeding with our T7. Well, I'm happy with that. Half past six in the evening in game. Tractors are all back here. All looking nice and clean as well. So whoever was asking earlier what tractors do we have on here. Here we go. These are our four tractors. Actually, going up in age. So, uh, you've got a 7810 Ford, a Ford TW25, a Ford 7840, and then a New Holland T7 220. Yeah, 220. Uh, we've got a JCB Telehandler, a, a New Holland uh, S2200, I think that is. Yeah, S2200. Uh, forage Harvester. And then just our uh, our truck as well. So that is all good. And I think that is us finished. We've not got any equipment out in any fields other than the lime spread up, which we'll go and pick up and do field 23 with next time. Uh, we're going to have to buy a grass field. So prices for that are 112 and 225. We're not going to be getting field 26 before the end of our first harvest. I think we have to borrow the money and get field 11. We've got enough um, we've got enough hay to do us at the moment, but we will need more hay. So, yeah, we'll grab that field. But otherwise, everything is good. So, I'm going to leave this here. Let's save this. There we go. Come out here. I will pause that. I will send us over to the Just Chatting screen. Um, and uh, I have a few thank yous to say uh, before we head off. And before we find somebody to hit that raid button on. So, um, I'd like to say a thank you. Uh, uh, it's a TW25 I have, Sean T. Um, I would like to say thank you to the devotee for uh, the raid and Twin Cam Gaming for the raid. Uh, you are both awesome. Daniel Kin Skinsberg, thank you very much for your cheer. Culture1983, thank you for resubscribing. Uh, Taken Fanatic393, thank you very much uh, for your cheer. Uh, Farming Girl 27, thank you for your resubscription. Uh, Angry Dad Adam, thank you for resubscribing as well. Um, and that is everybody. You are all awesome. 
Um, thank you everybody who's watched the stream tonight. We have had over a hundred people in here for most of the, most of the stream, and I am so very very grateful. Um, you are all utterly fantastic. Uh, let's go and see who we can go and raid. Who have we got tonight? Who is uh, who is streaming and raidable? Hello, Farmer John Twenty One. Welcome along. And but you come in right at the end of the stream. Um, my next stream, uh, while I'm looking for someone to raid, my next stream is Tuesday night at eight thirty. We'll be back here on Bessie Beneath. Uh, so I hope you can join me for that. Uh, multiplayer stream will be on Wednesday from eight thirty. Um, so I hope you can join me for that as well. Uh, video tomorrow on YouTube at 2 p.m. Uh, we are heading back to the Valley of the Old Farm. Uh, we are, at the moment, we are continuing in that series until we are able uh, to switch to uh, Dalton Valley Farm, uh, which will happen when, um, when Ian uh, uh, sends me over the DB pack, which I am so excited for. Um, but yeah, for now, we're going to continue on the Valley of the Old Farm until that happens. Um, so check that out at 2 p.m. tomorrow. We're actually making some headway on that series now. We are going to go and raid Martin ML Gamer because he is awesome. And because I want you guys, uh, go show him some love because he's brilliant. Don't forget, if you take part in the raid, uh, then you will get some BF Grope Marks towards entering the monthly giveaway, which this month is uh, for one of two copies of the Alpine Farming DLC to be released in November for Farming Simulator 19. And with that, all that remains is for me to say thank you for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this live stream. Please, if you are here on Twitch and have yet to follow, hit that follow and make sure you have notifications turned on so you never miss a live stream. If you're watching the VOD on YouTube, um, please drop us a comment, uh, give it a share, give us a like and for all the latest videos from Virtual Farmer, please subscribe to the channel and ring that bell and I will see you next time. Bye for now. <laughs>